productivity is that unicorn we all think we found only to realize that we are not getting much done. To master productivity and to lead an effective and efficient life, you need to constantly upskill yourself. However, which skill to target first? Where do you begin? In this video, I'm going to share with you four key skills which I feel that you must begin with to, of course, master productivity. Let's get started. Hi there, my name is Aparna. I am a certified coach. Every week I bring to you tips, tricks, tools and hacks that can help you upskill your life. And if this interests you, do consider subscribing to my channel. And while you're there, do not forget to press a bell icon so you're notified every week when I post a new video. Whether at home or at work, your skills make a huge difference to the way you are and how you behave. It also helps you become efficient and effective in whatever you do. When you Google, you'll come across a number of skills that you're supposed to have to say, get a good job or uh, to succeed in life. The list can be overwhelming. It can also confuse you. One of my mentees have actually told me this, that ma'am, there's so many skills out there. I really don't know where to begin and how deeper should I go? That is the purpose of this video. If your goal is to master productivity, then I believe that you need to start with four crucial skills. The first skill is curiosity. Curiosity could have killed a cat, but it's considered to be a leadership skill. And you know what? All of us are born curious. Remember how curious infants are? They want to know everything. And as they grow older, they want to know some more. When you inculcate curiosity as a skill, you will begin to question everything. Why is it the way it is? And what should you do to find solutions? You tend to seek answers and that will lead to the path of ultimate learning. Curiosity will not just lead you to the knowledge, but also give you the ability to connect the pieces of information that you gathered. The second skill is discipline or self-discipline. And it's considered to be one of the most important skills. Discipline will help you achieve your goals, weed out distractions and create an overall positive outlook in life. When you begin achieving things and with discipline you will, you want to achieve some more. This creates a winning habit. And when winning becomes a habit, you will push yourself to persevere your goals some more. Discipline can also make you mentally strong. And it's tied up to our third skill, which is commitment. Commitment is an evidence that you have an intention to do something genuinely. It increases a sense of responsibility within us and in others, trust. Being committed also helps you make long-term goals and a plan to achieve those goals. Believe me, commitment is one of the most sought after skill by the organizations these days. The fourth and the final skill in my list is resilience. Life is full of difficulties and challenges and failure is inevitable. It is impossible to get through life without being knocked down. But resilience as a skill will help you not just survive but also thrive in these adversities. You can say that resilience is our inner strength. It helps us adapt to every situation and makes us a winner. Plato said, excellence is not a gift but a skill that takes practice. We do not act rightly because we are excellent. In fact, we achieve excellence because we act rightly. The four skills I shared with you today, curiosity, discipline, commitment, and resilience are according to me, the most crucial skill set that you will ever need to master productivity. Learning all other skills is damn easy if you are able to master these. I hope you find this information useful and resourceful. Do leave me a note in the comment section below or you may reach out to me in any of the social media platforms that I'm in. Thank you so much for watching. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up and share it with your friends. And I'll see you next week. Until then, take good care of yourself.